You can sign up for SpaceX Starlink's DTC beta service today. Let's talk about it. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much once again, joining me for tea time today. We have a little bit of fireside. So good, that smokiness, that lap song. I hope you're joining me with your cup of tea, maybe a cup of coffee, hanging out, talking tech, talking photo, talking video. Today is a technology day. We may be talking about space, SpaceX, Starlink, T-Mobile. As of today, the DTC or direct to sell service is available for you to sign up. Beta, but still available. So this is really interesting. I've been talking to you guys about this for quite some time. I'm going to get into what kind of phone you're going to need. I'm going to give you a direct link to the sign up form where you can sign up for this service and all the rest of the stuff by the end of this video. I'll probably attach a bunch of stuff down below in the pinned comment as well as the description. So look down there when you're done watching this video. So speaking about when you're done watching this video, check out my SpaceX Starlink playlist. I'll put a link, don't click on it yet. I'll put a link over here. So when you're done watching this video, you can check that out. Also, if you enjoy the content, throw it a thumbs up. That's very helpful. Don't forget to subscribe. If you're not, if you are, appreciate that. Share it, share the video, share the channel with your community. Facebook, Reddit, wherever you frequent. I would appreciate that. Also, if you just want to say thank you for all of my hard work, there's a little thank you button. You can click on that. Give a dollar or two if you like. If not, the video is still free. Consider becoming a member of the channel. That would be even better. And if you want any of my free eBooks, go to jchristina.com forward slash books. jchristina.com forward slash books. That's the end of my shameless self-promotion. People complain about this. I put it at the beginning, right? So that if you want to fast forward, you want to just skip ahead, you can. Stop complaining. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this is really interesting stuff because DTC, I actually used it during the hurricane. Hurricane Milton, I think it was, that came through and it was pretty bad, especially up north, but I was down in South Florida. So we got hit with, I think it was 136 tornadoes. We didn't get the actual eye of the storm. We just got a ton of tornadoes. But at that time, SpaceX opened up SpaceX Starlink, the DTC or direct to sell service for anyone that's in the disaster area that got hit with those two major hurricanes a few months ago now. So very interestingly, I sat here with my wife doing the JC live show. If you don't know what that is, you should. 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Fridays, we do something called Free Speech Friday. It's the JC live show and we hang out with you guys and talk tech, talk all kinds of stuff. Anyways, she was sitting next to me and we did not have any cell service. And I made sure that cell wasn't working because I shut everything down. And we were able to, or I was able to text her next to me. And that's not through Apple's SOS. That was actually through SpaceX Starlink. That was really big. And the reason it was big is because my phone was in T-Mobile. It was working on AT&T because the FCC released it to be usable by all service providers. So it didn't matter if you're a Verizon or AT&T or T-Mobile or whoever, everyone was able to use it, not just T-Mobile customers. I think that's awesome. And maybe the FCC will do that in the future, right? So it's not just T-Mobile customers that can use it. We don't know. All right. But that was something that I found amazing because not only did it work, it worked well. I'm sitting in a studio with eight, eight and a half inch concrete walls, poured concrete. All right. So that means the signal had to be coming in through the roof. OK, think about that. And I'm sitting here texting with a satellite that's overhead through a roof. It's like I don't even know. Anyways, I want to go through an article or a few articles that I found to give you the basis of what's going on. And once again, I'll tell you exactly how you can sign up and everything else that's going on about it. Which type of phones can you use and this type of thing for the service. So anyways, we're going to get into this article and then I want to hear from you. What do you think about all of this? Is this something that you're interested in? Do you want this service? Are you off grid a lot and you don't have access to any cell towers at all, but you still need some type of communication this is your answer i'm telling you this is going to be revolutionary anyways like i said put a comment down below if you're shy you don't want to do that put an emoji down there i'm happy with that at least i know you were here that would be awesome 
Goodbye, dead zones. T-Mobile and SpaceX Starlink are teaming up to revolutionize mobile connectivity with a new direct-to-sell satellite service, eliminating dead zones across the United States. By leveraging Starlink's ever-expanding satellite network, this collaboration promises to keep you connected wherever there is a clear sky, no towers required. Well, let me fix that. No towers required, that is true, because the towers are in space. There's about 300 of them as of right now. But what I need to fix is you need to have access to clear sky. This is not Apple, all right? You do not need access to clear sky. As I just told you, I witnessed it, I was here. If you go back to the live, you'll see that it worked, and that was literally through a roof in a concrete building. So it works, all right? You don't need clear sky. Beta access and first responders come first. T-Mobile has opened beta registration for the service, offering it initially to postpaid voice customers with compatible devices. I'll get into that before the end of this video also. What is a compatible device? First responders, however, are at the front of the line. Given the critical nature of emergency communications, they'll have priority access as the service rolls out in its limited capacity beta phase. A T-Mobile spokesperson said, quote, our mission is clear, ensure that help can always be reached no matter how remote. A sky full of satellites. SpaceX Starlink has launched over 300 satellites capable of direct-to-cell communication, with regulatory approval to deploy up to 7,500 more. These satellites operate using T-Mobile Spectrum to bring coverage to areas where traditional networks simply don't exist, such as remote deserts, forests, and vast rural expanses. No extra gear, just seamless connectivity. What makes this initiative unique is its simplicity. Unlike other satellite services that require a satellite dish or awkward positioning, this system works seamlessly with your phone. Users will be able to send and receive standard SMS messages initially, with voice and data expected to follow later. All you need is a clear view of the sky, no special effort required. Once again, it doesn't have to be clear view of the sky. Keep that in mind. Global Ambitions Starlink's international reach. While T-Mobile focuses on connecting the US, SpaceX isn't stopping there. SpaceX Starlink has already formed partnerships with international telcos, including KDDI in Japan, Opus in Australia, and Rogers in Canada. These agreements set the stage for a global satellite-based network that could redefine mobile connectivity worldwide. Absolutely the case. Looking ahead, messages today, voice tomorrow. The service's beta phase will initially support only text messaging, but as the technology scales, T-Mobile and SpaceX plan to roll out voice and data connectivity in the near future, ensuring that dead zones become a thing of the past. As Elon Musk put it, quote, this is about making connectivity ubiquitous for everyone, everywhere. How to sign up? And what comes next? Beta registration is now open for T-Mobile postpaid customers with compatible devices. The service will officially launch for text messaging early next year with voice and data on the horizon. Mike Katz, T-Mobile's president of marketing, strategy, and products, promise is clear. Quote, if you can see the sky, you'll be covered. Nice quote, but once again, I couldn't see the damn sky and it worked. <laughs> Anyways, this is, I think, really, really powerful and not just powerful for emergency services, for first responders. It's going to be powerful for all of us to be able to just communicate with a loved one after, for example, the hurricane is just so amazing. Just to simply be able to say, listen, I'm OK. Don't worry about me. That's it. That is good enough in most cases. So this is, like I said, so powerful. People don't realize how powerful this is as of yet, but they will because I believe that this is going to expand. As of right now, we're seeing text, then we're going to move into voice and then data. Now, keep this in mind. This service is being broadcast through T-Mobile Spectrum here in the United States. And they talk about Rogers and Canada and so on and so forth. But this spectrum that's being used is T-Mobile Spectrum on the LTE network. LTE network, meaning that this service can get even faster down the road by broadcasting on 5G. 
So we'll see what ends up happening with that. But as of right now, they're using LTE. And if you don't know how it works, they basically are taking satellites, SpaceX Starlink satellites, and retrofitting them with E node Bs. An E node B is basically a modem, let's say, and it turns or converts a satellite into a cell tower. So instead of your cell tower being up the street, a mile or two down the road, well, the satellite is sitting at about 300, 400, 500 kilometers in space. I know it's amazing and a lot of people, they just can't believe that it's possible, but it is and it works and I can attest to it because I've tried it here once again in South Florida on my AT&T phone, even though this was T-Mobile service. Now, as I promised you at the beginning of the video, I'm gonna put a link in the description as well as the pinned comment. Maybe I'll throw it right here too. If you go to that link right now today, you will be able to register for that beta program. Once again, first responders come first, but you will be able to register and they will probably slowly roll it out. The other question that I'm sure you had, and I promised that I'll tell you, is what exactly is a compatible device, right? What is compatible? Well, like I just alluded to, this is not 5G, it's LTE. So any phone, any modern phone that allows you to get LTE or 4G coverage is going to work. If you have an older phone that only provides 2G or 3G, it will not work. So as of right now, you'll be able to get DTC or direct to cell connectivity with a LTE or 4G phone. That's all you need. And it doesn't need to be modified in any way. And you don't have to download some special app. And most importantly, it's free. <laughs> yeah. You see, I said this about three, four months ago. I said, you know what? T-Mobile is going to offer this to their customers for free. And a lot of you guys said, now they're going to take advantage of it. It's going to be $5 or $10 extra per month. And I said, no, nope, nope. This is going to be free service. And sure damn enough, it is free. If you have a T-Mobile account, as long as it is a postpaid account, right? Not a prepaid, but a postpaid account, a standard account. Guess what? you will be able to get this service 100% free. Amazing, right? Like I said, amazing. Anyways, guys, what say you? Down below, I wanna hear your thoughts. Is this something that will work for you? Are you a hiker or someone that's off grid a lot? Or maybe you're in a mountain someplace or in the middle of a desert doing Baja stuff. What do you do that this service might be perfect for? Remember, you do not need any connectivity near you and put together a SMS message right now and then in the near future, be able to make a phone call or do any type of data. No connectivity required, no Wi-Fi, no nothing, no cell tower in the vicinity. Amazing, absolutely amazing. How many lives will this service save worldwide? Just think about it, how many lives? I don't think we can grasp how this will revolutionize connectivity for the world, globally, not just for us here in the US. Just unbelievable, absolutely unbelievable. So once again, down below, I wanna hear from you. What do you think about all of this? Finally, head over to my website, jchristina.com, where you can find all the photography tools I've invented for you and me over the many years and my merch and my tees and my shirts and my books and everything else. Go over to jchristina.com, see if there's something that you like, and if you do, pick it up. Help support me and my family. Many blessings to you and your family. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay connected, and we'll see you in the next one. Love you all.